All right, ladies and gentlemen, motorcycle riders, all of you know that suspension is so important, so critical in every form of motorcycle racing. And here's a man who is an expert, Marcus McBain, M2 Shocks. Great to see you. Man, your company is taking off, your name's taking off. So first off, big congratulations on that. I appreciate that, Jack. Now, you have taught me a lot about suspension already, and I know we've been talking about revalving. Give me a quick lesson over here of what we're looking at. Uh, you know what, we've got our forks, uh, stock shock revalve kits, and then of course our S2 shock, which that's what setting a lot of world records right now. In fact, Adam Burroughs just set the the land speed record on Kawasaki H2 at 233 again yesterday. Wow. So that's three world records in a row for our, our uh, M2 shock on H2s. So that's kind of cool. So for any drag racers watching this that do not have a modified shock, what are the benefits? Uh, main thing is you're going to actually get control. Um, I tell a lot of guys that are running, let's say you're running uh, Crazy 8 or maybe a slower uh, ET than that. Man, a stock revalve is going to work real good with you. We, we actually took our time bringing out our stock revalve. This is off a uh, newer gen GSX-R1000, but it's not just revalving it. You want to have the control with the adjusters. You want to be able to have the custom spring. And of course, we put the bearings on there so we reduce spring torsion, torsion on, on the uh, actual shaft. Um, but it's going to be revalved. You're going to have the nice collar so it's easy to adjust. Um, again, the bearings on there like we do on our, our big boy shock over here. Okay. And uh, these go for 489. They're a really good value. Very cool. Yeah. Now, the cool thing about you with all your technology, former road racer, and all, all, I know you got a lot of fun computers and computer programs. You can set anything up for just about any application. Right? Absolutely. Absolutely. Very cool. Yeah, I mean, we, we're trying to come up with stuff. This is actually something we're going to be offering. This is uh, for forks. Anybody who's putting forks together knows it's almost impossible to put the cap on without crushing it down about three or four inches. This allows you to get a wrench in there so you can put the cap on without looking like a monkey uh, having fun with the football, as they say. I love it. And I see you got a bunch of other components over here. Yeah. Yeah. What yeah. else has been a hot product for you? Uh, T-shirts, obviously. That's the one with Frankie on the back. Gotta love Frankie. Yeah, gotta love Frankie. Uh, here's a set of our grudge forks for the ZX-14. Oh, grudge bikes. Okay. Yeah. And then this is just our mock stand, but we're actually going to be putting a load cell on this and showing how different linkage positions change the actual leverage into the shop. Awesome. So we ought to have that next month. Can't wait to see it, man. Well, Thanks, thank sir. you for everything that you do. And again, we just want to drive home the guys out there. They buy their clutches, they build their big motors, but don't forget suspension, right? Absolutely. Thanks, Jack. Thanks a lot. Hi, buddy.